everyone it's julie from downpour designs again um so this is a second variation on my ice fire coasters these are going to be ice bubble coasters here i'm starting with my pillow paint which is the glidden essentials eggshell white i'll put a pretty big circle on there and then spin it out until it covers the entire tile off the sides And see I got that one kind of lopsided so I had to had to do a little tilting, a little more spinning, little touch-ups on the sides. And I'm going to start, well, I'm going to spin again. <laughs> uh, first color I'm going to put down is going to be the TLP Velvet. It's an interference blue color. Super pretty, kind of creates a really, really light blue that's visible when you move the tile around in the end. So I'm just putting a little bit of that on first. I'm going to be doing a swipe on this one, so that's why I'm putting it on the side. Second color is TLP Hammerhead, one of my favorite colors. It's absolutely gorgeous. I don't use it enough. I probably should because I'd probably put it in every painting. And then the third color is going to be TLP Sterling. Nice silver going to put a little bit of that in there. I don't want a lot of that, just a little bit. And then the last color is going to be TLP Frost. I'm going to use quite a bit of this one. And you're going to see me actually put this on and then tilt the spinner because I put it too close to the back of the tile. <clears throat> and I didn't want it to fall off the back, so I was trying to keep it on my tile. And then using my Amsterdam Titanium White Cell Activator with my spatula. And I'm sorry, I don't remember what spatula number that is. I know it's a, a Liquitex spatula. I'm just putting a thin layer, don't need a whole lot. And then applying even pressure all the way across the knife. Kind of have it slightly tilted on that back side, slowly dragging it across the tile. And it's okay if you don't cover the sides because when you spin this, the cells are going to move off the sides as well. So you want to get it as even as possible, but if you don't get it all the way to the edges, don't stress about it. So I'm just watching the cells pop up here before I spin it out. And gentle spin, not a, not a fast spin. So you're going to see how it kind of moved out towards the edges. So I'm going to help it along a little bit on that one side. Um, wasn't quite getting as far over there as I wanted it to. And I'm also trying to get more cells at the top there. I'm going to spin it again. I'm just trying to kind of get some of the cell activator off the back side there. It's going to move really slow because I don't have a whole lot of paint on there. 
So I'm just waiting for that cell activator to just kiss the edge and start rolling over. And then I will spin it again. Real gentle, no hard spinning. I'm pretty happy with it at that point. Just looking it over, see if there's anything else I want to do. So I'll lift it off and show you guys. As best I can with my horrible lighting in my studio. And those are my ice bubble coasters. Thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and come visit me on Instagram and Facebook and TikTok. Thanks so much. Have a great day.